Hi, it's Kevin Sharp here from Evanru, New Zealand. We're at Sulphur Point in uh, Tauranga, and I'm here with uh, Russell Smith from Scorpion Boats in Tapuki. We've just been out uh, doing it with a couple of boats, doing some comparative testing and performance, and um, Russell's had his first opportunity to, to um, power up the Scorpion 610 uh, with the 90 ETEC and uh, we're interested to see how the, the Evinrude 90 um, compared. What were, you, what were your thoughts, Russ? Did it, did it sort of meet your expectations in performance? If anything, it's probably exceeded them to the extent that most of those 16 hardtops that go into the marketplace are fitted with a 100 or a 115. Yeah. So just the fact that a 90 is able to do the job admirably, yeah. I think there's a lot of credit to the engine. Um, throttle response, load carrying capabilities, and it appears that economically wise, in terms of fuel usage, it's shaping up very well. So for a relatively small horsepower engine, to be able to actually carry that job on a 16 hardtop, um, I think it's performing very well. Yeah. Yeah. So um, tell us a little bit about the boat, Russ. How long have you been uh, marketing that model? And, um, the six, yeah, the 16, for, uh, using that name, has been around for a long time. Um, and its current guys, obviously over time, the hard top's been modified a bit. Um, there's been small changes to the hull. Um, but it's one of those boats that it works. It, it's got a good price point. Um, it's got good head height in the cabin. It's got full length cabin bunks. It's a boat that just sort of works, and you'd have to say that as far as Scorpion product goes, it's the bread and butter. Like there'd be somewhere around the vicinity of between 60 and 80 of that one unit go out each year. Um, so it's a good boat, and people like them because they're not over the top, they're not full of every luxury in the world, but they're a good, honest boat that you can take you know, yourself and four mates fishing for a realistic dollar and have the protection of that hard top. Yeah, well, I was, I was impressed in the, uh, in the ride of the boat. We went over you know, when we were doing some of the speed runs, we went over some of the, the wakes and the ferries in the, in the inner harbour there, and, and it really performed well. It didn't, it didn't do anything that, that um, was undesirable in, in uh, handling. So yeah, no, great they, yeah, they, they are, they, and it's not worth changing that model too much because it is a good, honest boat that does what it does. Yeah. Well, that's fantastic, Russ. We, uh, we really appreciate um, being part of the, the testing and, and hope that we can, um, we can do some more boat testing with more of the range of our engines going forward, so appreciate you. Yeah, no, look forward to it. It's great to have the opportunity to try different products on the back of the boats. Yeah, fantastic.